made it to Peru. Why is it not respecting you? It's not putting you in focus, only me. Disrespectful. But we made it to Peru safely, and we're so excited to be here. And tired and hungry. Cool. And all of that good stuff that comes cool. with traveling. Guys, we made it to our hostel. There's Wi Fi. Shout out to the Wi Fi. And we're about to check in. As we were checking in, these guys right here invited us to go get some food. So we are off to go get our first Peruvian meal. Yeah, get all of that. <laughs> hey guys, so I'm about to try this. We found out that it's an alpaca heart. And if you watched my 50 facts video, you know I'm a super picky eater. So for me to be trying this is like a big step. Eat the whole thing. The whole thing? Go big or go home. <laughs> I'm almost <laughs> You almost don't <laughs> say it, say the words. Well, you almost don't hate it. It it tastes funny. <laughs> it tastes like <laughs> lamb. <laughs> You've never had lamb? Mm-mm. You don't like it? I think I'm freaking myself yeah, out. Just because you yeah. Ooh. I think I'm being dramatic, but I feel like I could taste the blood in it. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is. What time is it? I want to say like 5 a.m. Just a 4.40 a.m. We got to the airport at 3.30 a.m. And I found out that our flight to Cusco was canceled. So thank God they put us on another flight they were not going to. It took a lot of standing and waiting around. But we're on the 5.30 flight to Cusco. And we just got croissants and water. Because last night I ate that alpaca heart. What the heck was I thinking? I'm burping up. I'll pack a heart and it's disgusting. That was TMI, sorry, but these are my life struggles. Hey Tara, say hi to the people. Hi. All the struggles. <laughs> my arm is hurting from holding this camera, so I'm gonna see you guys in Cusco. They let us land. As soon as you land, they give you free cocoa leaves. This is to help with elevation. A lot of people get altitude sickness at their high elevation of 11,000 feet. We are taking a private cab from Cusco to Oliantaytambo, which costs us about 130 soles or 40 US dollars, 20 US dollars each. This is the expensive route, not the inexpensive route. And this has scenic routes along the way. We stopped at a gas station on our way there and these puppies were there. How adorable. And this is right before the scariest thing of our life happened. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and tell you about that. Guys, we just had the biggest scare. We thought that our cab left us at a gas station when we went to pee. And I was like, oh my gosh, all I have 
is all I need. My camera, my phone, and my passport. And all I had was my work phone, not even my personal phone. And everything else, I was just like, we're in the middle of nowhere. God, you're really tested and trying me. So. With the language we only marginally speak? Yep. That was really scary, like. Still, still reeling from that one. Yes, yes, for sure. And thank God that he didn't leave us. And uh, we are headed on our to way to see some beautiful views. Yeah. Where? What's it called? Miranda. 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 Miranda? Como se dice? Banda. Ah, Mirador. 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 Yeah. <laughs> and a market. And then to I guess Caliente so we can see Machu Picchu tomorrow yes. for Independence Caliente. Day, hot springs, hot springs, all that oh. good stuff. We're gonna relax oh. tonight oh. and enjoy our vacay and we not be stressed out. <laughs> we really have like flight got canceled, thought we weren't gonna land. <laughs> Then we thought our cat left us. We were scared for a good five minutes. Like we could not find him. We swore the car was black and was silver. <laughs> uh, like I need to relax. I need to not be stressed. So hot springs tonight. Hot springs, oh yes. show. Okay. R and R. R and R. What does that mean? Rest and relaxation. Oh, okay. Rest and relaxation. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I instantly became obsessed with these children. Like I wanted to take one home. How cute is he and how rosy are his cheeks? Gracias. Yeah. Gracias. Take a picture dish, no problem. Okay? For example, in this one, this is. Shout out to our awesome cab driver. He's so patient with us. He's so patient with us and he doesn't understand us really, but he's still working with us. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> Gracias. Up to Ole Tam. Te Tam. Ole Te Tam. Ollanta y Tambo. Ollanta y Tambo. Found this super cute place for lunch. So cute. Do you care which way you sit? You want to face no, that I don't mind. Come on. Your mother Maria took the photo. We don't ask too much. My mother is going to be here. And my mom. What you got there? Let me take my photo and me the plata. See? Mm -hmm. What is this about the cat? Uh -huh. <laughs> See? Yeah, they're in the chandle. Yeah, they're in the chandle. And the ball is the chandle. Yeah, the ball is the chandle. I love him! Oh, can I take you home? <laughs> He's like... <laughs> Mm -hmm. I love the little Peruvian baby. <laughs> can be friends forever. You can get in my van. I have candy. <laughs> it's still day one, and I'm about to tell you about another unfortunate event. So I went to take money out of the ATM and forgot to take my car back out. So the police officer was like, oh, I think you left your card in. It's beeping. So I went over there to get my card. As soon as I get over there, it sucks my card back in and tells me that I, it cannot return my card at this time and that I need to contact my bank. So it's day one and uh, I don't have any way to get money. So this should be interesting. And um, yeah, it's okay. It's all right, I'm in Peru. And I'm living my life, and uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna keep having a good time. We're just gonna not be stressed out. And see how it shakes out. 
how cute is this little train? Here are our seats. Hopefully we'll be sitting with some cool people across from us. Or no one. We will be. We will. Alright, All right. and just like that, we are about to head off to Agas Caliente so we can go to Machu Picchu tomorrow morning and do hot springs tonight. The ride from Oliente Tambo. Oliente Tambo. I still can't say it right. Oliente Tambo to Agas Caliente on the train is absolutely breathtaking. So many gorgeous views. Guys, we are getting to that point where we are just exhausted. We have just made it to August Caliente's at the beach. After B, after traveling all freaking day. Keep that. Yeah. I mean, we stopped several times, but we just been like going. So it's been a long day. Slept on the plane. I mean, not the plane, the train. My camera died, so I'm iPhoning it out right now. And we are headed up to the hot springs. We just rented a towel and flip flops. The hot springs were definitely a cool experience. I thought the water was going to be a little bit hotter, but it was still nice and relaxing. Good for us after a long day of traveling. After we left here, we just went and got food and met this super awesome Chilean guy that you guys see in the picture right here. And we just went back to our hostel and got ready for the next day, which is Machu Picchu. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my first Peru vlog. Be on the lookout for the next one. And be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, bye.